Okay. All right. Uh, <clears throat> Ajay, got that. Thank you very much for your time. I mean, uh, we could not touch, the, touch upon the global uh, picture, which we uh, hope to do with you in the next interaction. Appreciate it. Thanks very much. So that's the market uh, closing. 140 points lower. So exactly at about 22,300 is where uh, we are going to end, which is basically just under the 40-day. Uh, the 40-day as of yesterday's close was 22,311 and we are at uh, 22,300. Uh, so yesterday we broke the 20 day by just a bit today we've broken the 40 uh, so slowly but st steadily uh, you know you get, you're getting a bit of a pullback uh, here uh, just a quick look at uh, the large cap uh, large cap so bajaj is the big uh, loser uh, nifty stocks power grid uh, is the other one ongc hindalco and indusind bank are some of the others uh, which uh, which which saw uh, some cuts come through so uh, that's the pack mid caps and small caps by the way between 1.7, 1.9% cut, so much larger as compared to what you saw on the Nifty <coughs> uh, or the large caps today. Okay. Well, there was a clear defensive tilt to the markets today. So on the way up, the Nifty FMCG index saw day two of buying and good buying. The Nifty FMCG index was up close to about 2%, with HUL leading the charge 5.5%, Britannia, Nestle, ITC, all gaining close to about 1.5% to 2%. The other sector, which uh, was higher today, Ending with gains was IT, the Nifty IT index up 0.7%. Tech Mahindra TCS uh, led the charge there. Very quickly, talking about the broader market sell-off, 2% uh, down on the mid-cap index and large stocks have fallen today. Some of them, of course, are PSU. We've been pointing that out. Uh, the PSU rally is sputtering. So, you know, your Aircon, NHPC, SJVN, Central Bank of India, Sale, all of these stocks falling with a fair amount of uh, volume as well. But beyond the PSUs, I mean, look at stocks like SRF, Torrent Power, Prestige Estates, uh, something like an Inox Wind, uh, you know, quite a few of these names. Seat, Root Mobile, Just Dial, the big stocks and pretty widely tracked, well owned, and the cuts were between five, six, seven percent, depending on which one you were uh, looking at. Of course, the real estate was uh, one of the weakest links, as we've been pointing out. Sobha down another six percent, uh, and a couple of other lenders also on the lower side of the screen today. So all in all, ending with the Nifty just around the twenty-two thousand three hundred mark. Okay, well, with that, it's a wrap on this edition of Closing Bell. But don't go anywhere because we continue with all the market action. Up next is Markets Forward.